Hey everyone, I'm back to show you the setup of my everyday carry, my wallet Holborn. Um, I'll try to show you what has changed. I I've, I've just want to show you kind of recently um, what I'm using. I really, really, really love my Holborn just for my wallet and everyday carry. I have money that I usually put here when I have it. I hardly carry cash, but when I do, I'll put it there. I have this line little pocket notebook. I grabbed three of them that came in a pack, really, from Tuesday morning. I grabbed these. I got a number one Kate Boss Babe from Foxy Fix that I plan to use because I have field note size. However, I want the smaller size, which is this, just for notes on the go. So for right now, I'm going to keep it right here for scriptures or notes or whatever. I have a note section, but I like to be able to have something with no, no rings when I'm writing notes. This is my planner. So um, anyhow, these are the bottom tabs. I have notes, today, to buy, fitness, master task, details, which is my future planning, Yearly, random list, passwords, and list it. That's all at the bottom. And then at the top, I have today, right now, details, and year. Um, stickers are all in the pockets back here. I won't go into that or show those just because it's just stickers. But I have my dashboard up front. I always constantly change this out. Um, just depends. I have things to buy right up front and I use this little dash for it. Pictures of my family. I have notes right up front and then this is the tab that takes me back. I mean takes me right to my notes when I need to. So my first divider, if I can get there, um, is daily pages. So these are Marsha Bermucci. Um, I did not print them. A woman that was so freaking wonderful sent these to me for April May and June and um, because y'all know I battle the printer and I just I'm not I don't have a duplex printer so I have issues with printing um, so she is going to print these for me for the whole year and she's just so wonderful so these are my dailies I love to just you know track events to do's, things that's happened. Um, yeah, just right here and here is just kind of hard because Sophia has been kind of sick with a cold and so it's just been kind of rough. But anyhow, I love to use these paper clips that I bought from Tuesday morning to mark where I am. I did slit the pages on my dailies. I don't think I'll do that anymore. Um, I thought maybe it would be good because you know the rings always get in my way But I thought it would be good if I'm gonna you know if I could take them out and just kind of write on them and plan but I always forget that I've done that and um, It really kind of defeats the purpose and then when I'm changing my pages Sorry, wait When I'm changing my pages, it's kind of like it'll it'll just kind of kind of go like that and I don't like it so anyhow, that's my dailies. My next section, oh, back here is some goals and some daily tasks. I'm gonna do weekly tasks, just, you know, to I'm visual, so just so I know that these things are what I need to do daily and weekly. I wanna lose 10 pounds. We wanna put an offer in a home. Like, we just, just some goals. Um, the next one is weekly. These are, you guys have saw, the, you've seen these before. They're just a week on a page from Filofax. And I do birthdays, events, appointments, just future planning on these. I don't really care if they're, they're pretty or not. I just care about the actual planning aspect. Um, these are these little tabs up here from a sticker little kit that came from Hobby Lobby and I just kind of tab out the months. I like that they're small so you can't really see them other than when I push them back or from the side you can. So I have until August with these. I really love them. Yes. So my next divider is fitness. I have been just so horrible about my health and exercising since having Sophia. 
So um, I wanted my whole thing is we have a treadmill in our garage and I want to be able to just get on it, you know, at least three times a week. So I'm tracking that with these little Target dollar spot monthlies um, that look like this and I kind of keep two at a time. Last month, that's what it was and it's so bad. I worked it two times, guys, two. <laughs> So anyway, I want this section for motivation. Hopefully, you know, I flip through my planner every day. So I thought maybe if I saw this motivation area and tracker, I would totally get it together. So um, this little dashboard, I forgot the lovely woman that created it. But if you go into Etsy and put fitness dashboard, this little girl will come up. It's so cute. So um, I have that there. And then these food log. Um, inserts from so much crafting I don't I'm not going to use these honestly I, I might as well just kind of take them out because um, I love them it's just that my rings are too little and I want to be able to put in like a week or two a week or two and I'm already at capacity for my rings so this section will be fitness but you know, I'll probably put some motivational quotes, some scriptures in it, some really cute vision boards, but that's it. My next section is my master task list, and I got these little pages from dearplanner.etsy.com. Just more of a long-term brain dump. This is where everything will be housed, just things that I need to do versus my daily to-dos. So I have that. This next section is very personal. Um, it has passwords and tasks, I mean, um, personal data. I do have a wish list, and this is some that I, some things that I want, and a holiday list, and then my yearly and passwords. I do have a sticker sheet from Caden's mom plans shops. Yeah. So my last section is for lists. I noticed that when I'm out, I do really list a lot and I just recently put in blank, blank pages because I was thinking on things that I need to do for my house and things that I need to do for the kids' room and I was like, where can I put that? So I created an area for it, um, some things I need for the house, the kids' room, and then this little flamingo acetate that says list it has some blank sheets just so that I could do just that um, pin loop my baby girl more baby girl my husband and my son are back here believe me I'm obsessed with everyone not just Sophia <laughs> I got these really cute unicorn um, like daily this this little unicorn is doing daily tasks it's so cute I don't want to use them the girl that gave me the dashboard put these in there with my order and I am hoarding it just because they're so cute. I did get some other unicorn ones from Lovely Nano Lanny Co. They look like that. They're so cute, but I feel like these ones are like hand drawn or something. They're cute, so cute. So I don't want to use those. But these are my other stickers I just recently got. This says workout time, work on that booty girl. <laughs> so cute. Get in shape. Kaden Mom's Plans. Oh, wait. Kaden's Mom Shops. Goodness. Love her stickers. And then, then these are the other ones. I'm just a sticker lover. Let's just face it. So anyhow, those are there. and I'm going to cut them up to where they can fit in my planner but that's that so I have that here I finally found the little mr. mr. stash himself or smash um, smash guy I got two more which one will be for my giveaway it's a King company guy I got them at Tuesday morning for 49 cents and I just grabbed like three or four of them just so that way you know, I know a lot of people were looking for them, so I just, I don't, I only gonna probably include one in my giveaway soon, and then one that I got for another individual, but I like to just look at him, he's cute, I, I know everybody was like, he was, I, everybody, I think we found it from Hobby Lane, um, 
she had him in there and I don't know he's like a staple of the planner community and just reminds me of that so anyhow this is my setup I'm really loving my Holborn I always have a love-hate relationship with my Holborn I'll I've been in this for about a month or two now and I'll always as my wallet and I always end up either getting bored and moving out and going to a traveler's notebook but I do know that for my main planning this is the one that works the most and I know that but then sometimes I just kind of get like squirrel no I want to use something else and it just never fails but good old trusty Holborn I've had her for like four years almost the rings are completely perfect the leather is similar to our I was gonna say similar to the Malden but it's really really I think much more plush the Malden is I mean it's different this one has no rings I really want one that has the rings again I bought this one off the Facebook group I love that one too but anyhow that is my Holborn it's my everyday carry I love it so should you have any questions let me know um, I'm gonna film another video on my travelers notebooks that I'm using right now for Bible study and one that I put in my purse I'm not gonna include it in this video because I don't want it that long but anyhow thank you so very much for watching I pray that you are blessed stay encouraged and thanks for following me God bless you